Hello everyone, I'm James. Welcome to my channel. If you're already subscribed, then welcome back to my channel. I love you greatly. If you're not already subscribed, then I don't really know why you're not already subscribed, but it's free, so. <clears throat> oh, so I'm going to be showing you how to glitterize your photos, like you can see on screen at the moment. I found this Instagram artist, so shout out to her, definitely go give her a follow. Um, she used to be a dentist, then she discovered putting glitter over images and it became like a career for her. Um, that makes it sound really simple, obviously what she does is really good. But I'm going to be showing you how to do it. This is the glitter texture that I found, uh, I'll leave a link to it. And then you work on top of it with like little colourful things like that and I'll show you how to make the everything so yeah let's get straight into it back home smoking legal i got more slaps than the beatles foreign shit running on diesel dog playing with my native shit is lethal dog all right so first thing you're gonna want to do is drag the glitter over the image then you want to choose what you want to be turned into glitter so i'm gonna go for the shoes and his t-shirt so you want to use the pen tool to select the area that you want glittered. If you don't know how to use the pen tool, then uh, I'll leave a link to my pen tool tutorial in the description. It's a really useful feature to learn. And once you've got it, you'll use it for way more things than you thought you would use it for. So I'm just going around carefully. Oops, forgot what I was doing, just the t-shirt. And then you make a selection, then you turn the glitter layer on. And you want to basically make sure, make sure that the glitter layer is covering everything in the selection first, just by dragging it up. Then you want to use the pen tool, make a selection, copy the glitter, control C, control D to deselect, and I'm going to hide that layer and just paste this, which is the perfect shape for the t-shirt once dragged into the right location. And then I'm going to go through the layer modes until I find the one that looks the nicest. That looks pretty cool. Now we're going to do the same for the shoes, so we want to put the glitter layer, which is here, to be over the shoes. Now we're going to hide it. Now we're going to use the pen tool to select the shoes. Kind of want to do his socks as well. That looks pretty sick. That's called lighten. That looks sick as well. Okay, now I'm going to be showing you how to do the um, 
light effects on those on top of the glitter. You want to start off by selecting a color, so I'm going to select yellow. You want to make sure your hardness is down to zero. You then do a blob like that. You then select white and then go smaller and then do another blob inside like that. Make sure you're right in the middle. Now you want to on another layer do just a white blurry dot like that. Press Ctrl and T. Drag it out really wide and then drag it down so that it looks like that. With that you then want to duplicate and rotate. You then want to merge these both together by selecting both of them and then right clicking merge and then turn it until it's for like 45 degrees in each direction. You then want to clip it onto this. You then want to merge all of those together. Actually, maybe we'll keep that separately. And then merge these ones together. Then you just drop them on top. Make them a bit smaller maybe. And you change the colour of each one. You do that by clicking the layer, selecting hue and saturations, clipping it, and then rotating the colour like this. And then I'm going to drag just ones that I like from up here with the same colorway and just drop them down here. With these ones I'm literally turning the saturation off so that it's just a completely silver um, shine thing. I think that looks a bit nicer on the shoes because the glitter looks like stronger. Now here I'm going to do the back of this shoe here and just make it quite dark so it's not very visible. And that pretty much concludes the tutorial. You can do this with so many things, it's super quick and easy to do and I think it like can create really cool artwork. If you do it with the right thing you have to find like the right object or the right bit of photography. Um, and if you have the artistic eye for that then this is something that's really fun to do, just throwing glitter on things. Uh, so anyway yeah, if you do give this a go, uh, make sure to show me, you can join the discord and post your artwork in there. Uh, we have like a judgement channel so you can get feedback on there. 
Um, but yeah, if this video helped you in any way, drop a like. If you're new to the channel, then I'd appreciate if you subscribed, if you like this kind of content anyway. Uh, and yeah, I hope to see you in one of my future videos, guys. That is all from me. Take care. Peace. I got big dreams on my watch, got a big face. Girls getting missing like a motherfucking mixtape. Smelling like money and I'm looking like sexy. I'm outside for real with the slimes and the snacks.